tell me the truth. I want to know. I think we are in The Apprentice. President Trump fired Rex Tillerson as Secretary of State, and surprisingly, not through Twitter. Trump revealed that CIA Director Mike Pompeo would be the new Secretary of State and thanked Tillerson for his service. The president said he and Tillerson had disagreed on some issues, including the Iran nuclear deal. I'm sure you've heard that students want change ASAP and they're making sure it's crystal clear. Well, students across the country walked out for 17 minutes, one for each victim of the Parkland High School shooting, to demand changes on gun laws. Reportedly, Senate Republicans are working to pass a modest background check bill in an attempt to avoid a full-blown gun control debate. A newly installed pedestrian bridge at Florida International University collapsed onto several lanes of traffic, killing at least six people. The bridge was put in place on Saturday, but was not opening until next year. The National Transportation Safety Board is now investigating this tragedy. Police are considering the possibility that the three packages that exploded at homes in Austin in just a 10-day period could be hate crimes. The two victims, one was African-American and the other one Hispanic. However, they do not have an official motive yet. According to a local newspaper though, the city has some of the highest rates of income segregation in the country. The brilliant physicist and best-selling author Stephen Hawking died at the age of 76. Hawking was known for looking into how the universe works, especially those black holes that we still do not know how they work. He also wrote the bestseller A Brief History of Time and was the focus of the film The Theory of Everything. The scientist had been diagnosed with ALS more than 50 years ago, which severely limited his physical movements. I feel like it was all bad news this week, but what's new?